Welcome to the Municipal DataWorks Capital Infrastructure Investment and Improvement Planning Module Training Video Generate Categories Part 2. In the previous video, categories of assets were generated within the module. The second method to generate categories is to copy the categories from the Asset Valuation Module. For this video, the asset type I am selecting is Vehicle. For this asset, I want to create a condition-based capital plan, therefore I select Curve as the forecasting type. To start the process of copying the vehicle categories from the Asset Valuation Module, click the Vehicle Asset Type. I must now select the type of curve I want to use. Deterioration curves are used to predict the condition of the asset at a future age. In the CI3P module, there are three options to choose from. An S-curve is typically used when the condition of the asset changes only slightly in the first few years after acquisition or construction, as the case may be, and then deteriorates faster as time moves forward. At the end of the asset's useful life, the rate of annual deterioration slows. However, at this point in time, the asset's condition is usually less than acceptable. A straight curve indicates the asset deteriorates at the same rate year after year, and a parabolic curve would be used when the asset deteriorates at a slow rate over most of the asset's useful life until the end of the asset's useful life, when at that time the condition of the asset deteriorates rapidly. Select the curve to be used by clicking the curve type. I'm choosing S-curve. Input the name of the plan. Select from the pick list the type of condition rating to be used. In this example, there is only one condition rating type to select from. That may not be the case for other asset types. Input the maximum condition rating. As vehicles do not have a standardized condition rating, the scale is user defined and could be a scale from 1 to 10, 1 to 20, or 1 from 100. Input the maximum value for the scale you have developed. Input the life expectancy of the asset. Check default if this is the curve to be used for all future capital planning. Click Save. There are no categories generated for vehicles at this time. To copy the categories from the Asset Valuation Module, click the View Category Configuration button. Click the Copy Categories from Asset Valuation button. To review the criteria copied from the Asset Valuation Module, click View Categories. In my example, Vehicle Type was the only criteria used to categorize like assets in the Asset Valuation Module. For capital planning, I am confident this criterion will be sufficient. If, however, Vehicle Type does not properly categorize all vehicles, additional criteria can be added. Follow the same steps as outlined in the Generate Categories Part 1 video to add additional criteria. If the criteria is sufficient, click Next. Click Generate Categories. If there is a category exception, correct the exception and click Finish. Thank you. Municipal DataWorks is a member service of the Ontario Good Roads Association. Our IT partner is Altus Group.